Taking action for you tonight, we're answering alarming questions about one of the country's most popular dog foods. A Florida law firm suing Purina, claiming their Beneful brand is making dogs sick, some with even fatal consequences. ABC Action News reporter Alex Hobson is live in the newsroom with the latest on this developing story and what you need to know. Alex? Well, just to emphasize the scope of this, we posted this on our ABC Action News Facebook page, and it's already been shared a whopping 32,000 times. I've also spoken with multiple people right here in the Bay Area who tell me they feel duped by their dog food. Come get your bum. I've had that dog for almost 10 years now. I mean, that is... A family member. So this past year, when little Ingve, her beloved Minpin's health, started to deteriorate, he started seizing up to twice a day. But until last week, she says she never would have expected it was her dog food, Purina Benefol, that was potentially to blame. They said it's the healthiest food to give your dog. Obviously, that's incorrect. After just one week of changing her dog's kibble to something else, she says she's noticed a dramatic improvement in Ingve's health. And after seeing our station's online report on abcactionnews.com, Jones became the newest addition to the class action lawsuit, alleging Purina's popular Beneful brand, which includes these eight types, is hurting and in some cases killing dogs. He had a seizure, kidneys gave out, and he died in my arms. All these dogs that are getting sick all across the country, the common denominator is the Beneful food. James Young of Morgan & Morgan is one of the attorneys filing the suit, claiming the dry dog food contains toxic substances. But in a statement to ABC Action News, a corporate spokesperson called the lawsuit baseless, saying consumers can continue to feed Beneful with total confidence. But Jones isn't buying it. Remove the product and just send it on its way. But right now, all eight brands remain on store shelves as the company maintains it's a high-quality, nutritious food. But if you feel it may have caused your pet problems, well, lawyers want to hear from you. We've gone ahead and posted on our website. You could see it right here, the link to join the class action lawsuit. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Alex Hobson, ABC Action News. Alex, thank you. Taking action for you, the SPCA tonight releasing these guidelines to help you choose a healthy dog food. Their first suggestion is check the ingredients. Animal protein like chicken or fish should appear first on the list. Second, there should be no wheat or wheat gluten. Also, look for a phone number. The company should have a website and any company should welcome your questions. Also, avoid any chemical preservatives. Also, look for the AFCO symbol. The Association of American Feed Control officials has strict regulations for pet food. Wendy?